Hello everybody! Welcome to Grim Gaming. This is Grim. Today we're playing some more GeoGuessr. We are doing the daily challenge, as always. Um, unfortunately, uh, I still have a silver score on here, but uh, we're currently at 33 days in a row played. Um, I did have one day where I did not get the... Um, did not get the video uploaded because of uh, some technical difficulties. But uh, let's go ahead and get into this. Uh, I am a little bit pressed for time. So uh, as always, the daily challenge is a world map. Uh, and we do have three minutes to uh, move, pan, zoom, whatever we feel like doing. So let's go ahead and get started. Uh, that being said, I will actually probably try and give my thoughts as I, you know, as I start. And we'll see. So this is uh, going to be the Ukraine because of this uh, uh, red car here. Um, not entirely certain where it's going to be at. Uh, you can also notice that it does not have uh, the EU plates. It's got EU style, but does not have EU plates. Um, not really sure. Uh, I was hoping we might be able to see. Um, we may, we may get to see it. Um, it depends if I can find the correct one. Yeah. So they'll either have the white plates like this, or a lot of times they will have white plates with a blue and yellow um, patch on it. Uh, can't really can't really see and to be honest with you uh, I'm kind of running out of time here. I think it's Chivintar. I'm not entirely certain. Um, German military cemetery. Not really certain on that one. That is military. I think you. I think it may have it there, but it's really hard to tell. Um, let's see here. This looks like a sign, but I don't know if it's actually really very useful. It's Belgor. Belgorod. Free something. Um, I'm running out of time here. River Kharkiv. I don't know if it's the... Uh, yeah, Kharkiv over here, but I don't know where the river is. Udiot River? Udi River? River, okay, it's up here. Uh, so that was actually pretty close. Um, the uh, apparently this is the Kharkiv River, not this direction. Um, I don't know which way I was going. I think I was going this direction, so it must have. Yeah, so I went down this direction. Maybe would have been better going up this direction, because there was a very large intersection up here or interchange. Um, but, uh, I did manage to, and so apparently this is a, uh, German military cemetery, German war cemetery right here. Um, but, uh, yeah, so 8.5 miles, um, yeah, uh, could have been, could have been a lot closer, but not bad, uh, that Kharkiv at the, river Kharkiv at the end really saved my ass. Um, 
this looks like it could be potentially uh, Finland or something like that. I'm not entirely certain. Could be Sweden as well. I don't think it's Norway. Pretty sure it's Baltic. I mean, pretty sure it's Nordics. Drop a bonk real quick while I spend time looking. Um, it's definitely uh, Finland or Finnish sounding. Um, I don't know if it would have been better going the other direction. I'm not finding any. Thing. The only good thing is I am actually seeing, I'm seeing a, several vehicles, so it may not be a completely dead rig. Oh, shit. I hate when it does that. Like I'm trying to go quickly somewhere, and it jumps me back. Um... I don't know if that's going to be, I can't actually even see what it says. Um, sadly, this appears to be a very small road. Um, there is, that looks like a fairly large, so it could be anywhere over here. Um, it could be up here as well. There are lakes. It's probably not that big, actually. Let me just let me go there. A little more central. Ooh, 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 uh, hold on. Uh, just uh, something in Talvanian. Let's see if there's anything. Seeing it, it might be too small for this. Not the right one. Ah, oh, shit. I was over there. Honestly, I think that was closer. I think my first guess was closer because I think I was probably somewhere like right there. Um, 37 miles wasn't great. Um, let's see. Not really. Um, oh my god, are you kidding me? I think I went north. If I went south, let me just check. I think I went north. Vasa, I have known was there. Oh my god. <sighs> but to be fair, like this kind of looked like there was something down that way because it like was paved road and back this direction wasn't. So I went north instead. I'm a little frustrated at that. Um, it, it could have been better. It could have been worse, but um, that's frustrating. Like I was so close to an actual like main highway with a giant city. Like I'd have been able to see that Vasa from there, and I would have known I could zoom in. And there's the other one. Like I could have like easily gotten almost a 5K possibly. Uh, 
So this looks like Mongolia. It is Mongolia. Um, you can kind of tell just like this landscape. Um, but you also have the vehicle here. Um, I don't have the camping gear on here. And we're not in Ulaanbaatar, obviously, because there's no large buildings here. So it's possible that this is over near Erdenet. Um, I'm not 100% certain, but the bars match because there's two different types of bars in Mongolia, one with the black inlay and one with this look here. But with this look, because this look is going to be, um, so Erdnet, Darkhan, this area over here, the black inlay is going to be Ulaanbaatar and farther out this way. Um, there's only three like cities that have coverage. It's Erdnet, Darkhan, and Ulaanbaatar. So this is probably going to be this road here. I'm not entirely certain, but uh, the direction of travel looks uh, looks right, and the bars look correct, and the lack of camping gear looks correct. Um, usually, if you are further out um, from one of the major cities, you're gonna like have like the like camping gear. Um, And like I said, uh, with with no camping gear, um, we should definitely be in um, in the vicinity of those three. I'm pretty sure that uh, I'm pretty sure that this road uh, here is like the only road, um, the only east west road like this where you don't have the camping gear. I'm not. 100%, but I will be honest, I don't, uh, I haven't looked at my uh, Mongolia car map in a while um, since I made it last year, really. But uh, I did spend a lot of time making a Mongolia car map. And this, this actually makes sense because. Um, I was actually like pretty darn close. I was gonna say um, right around this area here, um, there's a bunch of broken coverage. Um, and you may actually be able to see it on like there's broken coverage here, and I think we were headed this direction. There's broken coverage here. Um, yeah, so that makes a lot of sense right there. Um, broken coverage. Uh, like I said, if you go up here, you have the uh, um, the camping gear. This is what I'm talking about, camping gear here. Um, I'm pretty certain that this is the only road right here between Erdnet and Darkhan that is this uh, east-west style road without the camping gear, because if you go down here, uh, you have camping gear, um, even um, even pretty close to the city. Maybe not exactly in the city, but uh, but this is a good road here. So, um, but as soon as you get out of the city, um, where is it right here? That's not even the uh, main road I was thinking I was clicking. Yeah, like, you get a bunch of, uh, um, a bunch of camping gear stuff, um, in this area, um, camping gear, snorkel, uh, I believe everything this direction has, maybe not, uh, but it's all snow out this direction too, so, um, 
but yeah. Um, so I guess it could have been over here, but like I said, that's going to be mostly snow. Um, get in here really quick. Yeah, it starts getting like camping and everything here. But again, this area is more green over this direction anyway. This is like not as green. But yeah, I was fairly certain it was on this road though. Two point three miles. I'm definitely gonna take that one. Um, this looks like it's probably uh, Argentina. This should be an RG pole here. Although this, all right. So we've got the middle finger Uruguay pole, um, which is. Uh, somebody on uh, another stream had described it, the middle finger. And we've also got the square white posts, which are from Uruguay. Uh, Argentina would have metal poles, metal, metal posts. Um, this looks like an Argentina pole here. And these definitely look Argentina. But this is, like I said, these are the middle finger poles uh, from uh, Uruguay. And these are Uruguay posts as well. So I'm very, I'm confused, but I'm thinking it's got to be Uruguay. Because I've never seen the middle finger poles. Argentina. I think I have seen those other concrete poles in Uruguay. I'm pretty certain I've seen them before. Uh, not very common, but like I said, I don't think I've ever seen the middle finger poles in Argentina. So I'm thinking this has to be Uruguay. Um, now, I'm not really coming across anything, and I'm probably going the wrong direction, um, like I've done uh, seemingly every freaking, oh my god, again, I'm trying to rush through here, so I'm trying something. I definitely went the wrong way, I'm fairly certain. About 30 seconds. Twenty-one seconds, twenty seconds, alright. Alright, just fucking go. Um Yeah, this just pisses me off. I seem to have a knack for choosing the wrong direction to go. Ah, 51 miles. Alright, so it was uh, Uruguay. Was... Apparently I was going down this fucking direction or some shit like that. I guess. And there's not a fucking sign. Why didn't I go this way? I don't know why the fuck I didn't go this way. Like, like that literally would have told me exactly where I was. Why didn't I go that way? I'm trying to remember what my thought process was. I spun around. 
looked at those poles, I looked at those poles, I saw these poles, I moved up to check these uh, concrete posts here. And then I went up to this one to check this one, and then I just continued on thinking maybe there would be a sign at the um, end of the trying to logically think of how I can screw up every freaking time. Like... I don't even understand it. It, it does, doesn't fucking make sense to me. Nice one. this lava. That's useful. Um, is this a church? Is this a church? Um, I think it is a church. So we are in Slovakia. Um, and there is a very good place to spawn. Let's see if I can find it based on this lava. Goes north there and that way. Does it need to continue on? Could be something right there, but that's not really what it is, Dad. Let me just go ahead and place a marker. Should be along this tram line, I would think. Could be something like that. Uh, let me look for a church right there. All right, we're right there. This has got to be here. Um, so where did we start? We started literally just north there, right next to this church right there. I mean, this should be it, right? I think it is. Yeah. This makes a lot of sense here. Right there. Um, G bar. Doesn't see. A Baroque Catholic church with a Baroque interior. Yep. So this is Dom Cuvatus. Cuvatus. It doesn't say Dom on it, but I can see. Urbanano. Yep. Yeah, we should definitely be right there. So this should be a 5K right here. Oh, boy, Alex. All right. So overall, not bad. Um, pretty close in Mongolia. Um, this one here, a little frustrated. Let me actually just switch it. A little frustrated here, um, 37 miles, um, I, I went the wrong way and came up here, um, I think, I think, uh, Rumi probably went the wrong way as well, um, what did, what did number one, number one was in Ukraine, so, uh, Rumi found, uh, exactly where we were there, he found where we were in, Uruguay, and, and basically found where we were in 
Mongolia and uh, uh, Bratislava. Uh, he didn't get the 5K on either of those, but pretty close. Um, he was pretty far off on uh, uh, Finland, which I'm going to chalk that up to him doing the same thing I did and going north up this direction. I think this is where I had uh, stopped and come across the uh, that bridge or something like that. I think that, no, maybe that was right here. No, because it's way too small to do that. But I think this must have been it, like, where I'd come across that. It was just so annoying. So annoying. Um, anyway, uh, overall, 99 miles altogether. Not bad, not bad. Um, like I said, if I went the if I went south here, I'd have definitely been able to pretty much five k. If I had um, went this direction to this intersection instead of down here, because I got all the way past. This is where I clicked and it skipped me back to here, and I still managed to get down and around this corner. So I got like way down here, and I could have easily done that. Um, but yeah, so overall, not my best showing, uh, not my worst. At least it was a, at least it was a gold. Um, we are up to thirty-four days in a row played, and this should be a good video. Thank you guys for watching, though, and you guys enjoy. Have a good day.